If you want to get the dynamic island on your Samsung Galaxy A36 5G, then first of all, we're going to go to the Play Store and we're going to download an app that allows us to get the dynamic island. So let's search. Let's tap over here and we're going to enter dynamic island. And you should be able to find this dynamic spot. Let's install it. This is a free app. It has the premium version as well, but if you don't want to pay for it, then you don't have to. The free version is good enough as well. And let's open it. So let me show you how to set it up. So then we need to press the next button here. Now we need to set it up. So first let's press select apps. Here we need to select all apps uh, that you wish to have uh, compatible with the dynamic island. So all apps that should be popping up with the dynamic island. You can just press all in the top right corner if you want to or you can select specific apps. So I'm going to select all and let's go back. Then we have notification access. So we need to grant the notification access. Let's tap over here. And here we have dynamic spot. So we need to tap on the switcher and press allow. Then we have draw on screen. So let's press this button and then press allow. And then once again, tap on it and press next. Go to installed apps and you should be able to find dynamic spot and then turn it on and press allow. All right, and then we can press done. Over here we have the pro version, but we can tap X in the top right corner. And the dynamic spot is pretty much good to go. However, we're gonna also go to position here in order to adjust the size, because as you can see, the dynamics island is actually pretty small. So I'm gonna change the size, the horizontal size a little bit. I'm gonna make it wider, perhaps something like this. And I'm going to actually make it bigger as well. Maybe not as big, but something like this. And now I'm going to also move it up just slightly. Let's see if, if we can move it up. And I think this is good enough. So we are good to go. Of course, now if you receive a notification, it might be visible over here in the, in the dynamic island. Of course, if you use the app settings or something, you will see ads from time to time. But you can adjust some settings here in order to make the dynamic island work as you wish it to work. And that is pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.